What is good YouTube? My name is George. This video is cruiser wheels versus normal wheels. It is right after work in New York City. I'm out here skating at this completely empty park. It's freaking beautiful. I need a skate tester real quick. What you just saw is what I would call me using my normal wheels. I'm using the Bones STF 52 millimeter. And for cruiser wheels, I actually have the Bones 56 millimeter ATF. ST Bruh. STF stands for street tech formula, which literally means these wheels are for street skateboarding. And ATF stands for all terrain formula. These wheels should take you cruising on all sorts of rugged terrain. The main purpose of cruiser wheels is, well, cruising. They typically are bigger in size and are made of a softer material. The combination of the softness and bigger size of the cruiser wheels lets you go over cracks, pebbles, and rough surfaces, and you can basically just focus on going really, really fast. On the other hand, street wheels are generally smaller, I ride 52s, and they're made of a much harder material. Typically, street skateboarding wheels have the ability to power slide. So what it really comes down to is the street wheels give you more control, and the cruiser wheels give you more speed, and you have to think about pebbles less. You can definitely use street skateboarding wheels to get around but you have to kind of think about every crack pop over and avoid pebbles and you'll occasionally bust your ass. I have actually yet to bust my ass skating with the cruiser wheels. Oh, and one more important difference between them is that cruiser wheels bounce much higher than street wheels. Bruh, bruh, bruh. You can certainly skate with cruiser wheels. It's just more difficult. I will pop some no complies and tray flips on my way to work sometime. Jesus. The fact that the wheels are bigger makes wheel bite inevitable. Wheel bite literally almost killed me. I think me. the hardness of street wheels helps with your tricks because your wheels slide on the ground more than you think. And finally, bigger wheels means heavier wheels. So my board is simply much heavier when I have cruiser wheels on, which makes it more difficult to do skateboarding tricks. This video is actually brought to you with a little bit of help from Bones Wheels, who sent me some pretty cool stuff recently. These are the Bones Rough Riders. These are cruiser wheels. But here is what's going to give this video a little twist. These are a pair of Bones ATF. Technically, these are cruiser wheels, but they are 52 millimeters so you could see the size difference there i'm curious if these things are gonna do what they say they're gonna do let's start with a little unpacking that manual would literally make me eat on normal wheels keeping up with this taxi this better than the car and I get to get through traffic Whee! now the question I want to answer is can the 52 millimeter bones ATFs blend the gap between cruiser wheels and normal wheels these wheels are the same exact formula and hardness as the bones rough riders they both feel very soft as if I could take a bite out of them is it possible that these things would cruise just as good as a cruiser wheel, but do tricks at the skate park just as good as a normal wheel? If the answer to that question is yes, these will be the ultimate dual purpose skate wheels. It will eliminate the need to switch between cruiser wheels and normal wheels. Let's go see if these are the god wheels. Let's find out. Couple observations from my first run down the street. One is that they feel more like the cruiser wheels than the normal wheels. Two, they're blazing through cracks no problem. And three, they're not picking up as much speed as the cruiser wheels and I'm guessing that has to do with the size of them. I would certainly say they get the job done for cruising. Not quite as fast, but pretty damn good. I got a hand delivery. Yes, yes. Thanks for that support. Oh, you make sure it's, oh, it's yeah. so sick. You wanna say what's up? Hey, what's up guys? What's up? Can you do it early grab? All right, we're at the local, hey. and we're matching. <laughs> I'm here with Jaeger. Hi. I want you to try out these Bones ATFs. These right here? Yeah. All right. And I want you to notice how quiet they are. All right, try them out. See really? what you think. Oh my God, these are smooth. They're so smooth. Oh my God, it feels like I'm breaking the floor. Yeah, <laughs> all the noise is coming from these right now. You could see it on the ground. 
All right, what's your initial thoughts? I'm not a big fan of big wheels. This guy thinks lot. 52 is big. Yeah. Anyways. I'm like a 47 kind of guy. <laughs> I like how quiet they are because when I power slide, it hurts my teeth. Wait, what does it have to do with teeth? I don't know. It's like I hear the noise and it just hurts my teeth. I've never heard that in my life. Damn, that wouldn't have happened on my wheel. Fuck, this is hard. Even Damn, boy. You buckled your Wow. You gotta keep that shot on the top. Yeah. Perfect. My turn on these things. Let's get it. Let's get it. And even if the sun goes down on you, you gotta keep that shot on the top. Yeah. Oh my god, that's that like was beautiful. Example, I... Tricks that don't require your wheels to slide on the ground work just fine. But for tricks that require your wheels to slide on the ground, these things will just completely stop. Yes. Hell yeah. That was all pivot. Yeah. Oh. I'm cruising through the city. Had to get outside, they couldn't get any more pretty. I'm moving. Hey, who's coming with me? On my bike, making 20 feel like 50. Man, they miss me. Hey, got the pedal moving swiftly. Vibe like suns, and I had to raise them strictly. Wishing I could always stay this way. Hey, chilling by the bait. Had to make me say that even if the sun goes down. In conclusion, the 52 millimeter Bones ATF are way more like a cruiser wheel than a normal wheel. The skate park session I had with these things was pretty lit. I was able to really get a session and do a lot of tricks, but the problems came about when I wanted to slide on the ground. And for the type of skateboarding that I do, I don't think it's really worth taking these things to the skate park. The second I put my Bones STFs back on, I felt like my ability was unleashed. So even with the small size, they're not just like a normal skate wheel. These Bones STFs are just so perfect for the skate park. I think for me personally, it would be worth having one pair of normal skate wheels and one pair of big cruiser wheels, as opposed to kind of having a hybrid of the two. But this video has made me conclude that what makes a cruiser wheel is more the formula and less the size, although the size will give you more speed. What a magical wheel. This thing is fascinating. I really want to eat it. 1,000 likes. I'm just kidding. Thank you for watching. Check out all these products that I mentioned in the link in the description, and I appreciate you. Go shred on, have a good sesh. In conclusion, in conclusion, in conclusion, the as my bone, as my bones, FST.